What's up everybody, it's BC. Welcome back to another video. If it is your first video, welcome to my channel as you have stumbled across one of the best channels on YouTube to help you in your life and business and everywhere else. I wanna to talk today about the number one mistake that you are making as a business person and as a salesperson, and this applies to more than just real estate. This could be applied to every single business out there, right? We have come to a point now where, especially if you're new or maybe you're struggling or your production in your business isn't where you want it to be, we're getting into this needy mode of, I gotta get a deal now, I gotta get a deal now, I gotta get a deal now. And it's, okay, either you're gonna do business with me or not, or get out of here, on to the next, on to the next, on to the next, right? I see it in real estate, do you wanna sell, no, buy, do you wanna sell, no, buy, do you wanna buy a house, no, okay, buy. And it's like this constant like jabbing to find one, and you may get one, right? However, you're always in this chase mode. Uh, you're, 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 you're frantic, you're, you're panicked, you're needy which are all bad emotions and they give off bad vibes, number one. However, that would be a separate lecture on the vibe, right? The number one mistake you make is that. That's part of it, right? What really encompasses this mistake is you're so focused on now that you are not, this is a two part thing, you're not building your pipeline long term and number two, you're not collecting people's information and putting them into a system where now you will stay in contact with them, right? It's called sphere of influence, personal circle, whatever you want to call it, your database. I don't like the word database because database implies that there's no human element and it's just a fucking number. And if people feel like you treat them like a number, they're not gonna do business with you, right? So name it what you please, whatever you want. Your database, I'm gonna call it database just for the sake of this video, okay? Are you building a database? Do you have a database? Most people don't even build one, and the few percentage that do build it, they don't even work it right. I will raise my hand because when I started in real estate, which is my business, I fucked up, All right? Right when I started, yeah, I was contacting them. I got a couple deals, and then whoosh, I put them to the side, and I was chase, 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 and I drove myself crazy. And now my database is flourishing. We're getting a lot of referrals. However, it would be at a completely different level right now if I had built it correctly from the beginning and I did not do that. So let this video be a testament for you to begin to do it correctly. I don't give a shit what business you're in, this is key. Even if you're in a business, it's a one call close. What do you do if they don't close? Do you just never talk to them again? You have their information there, follow up with them later, and then again, and then again, until they buy or they tell you to go fuck yourself. And even if they tell you to go fuck yourself, say, well, real quick before I let you go, do you think you might be interested in the future? Right, you never give up. That's a joke, but you get what I'm saying. Build that sphere of influence, build that personal circle, build that database, whatever that thing is, because then you're gonna create this, this huge vortex, this huge like cloud of people that you can just put your arm in at any time and talk to them. You're gonna create relationships and then you're gonna get to the point later where your business model is gonna be completely fed with people that already know you, like you, and the kicker, the most important one, trust you. If they know you, think about this. Let's say you have somebody in your circle who's a business person that you know, they send you emails regularly, they call you every once in a while, you get a text from them, what does that tell you? They're professional, they're still in the business, they're working hard, and they come through with their word. They said they would stay in touch with me and they have, right? What else would you want as a business owner than to establish that? And most importantly, what encompasses all that is TOMA, top of mind awareness. You have that, you have a lot of people who know you, like you, and trust you, guess what? You're gonna be a very, very, very important and extremely profitable business. However, a lot of people don't wanna take the little extra effort to build that. And if you do that, my friends, it will completely transform your life, your business, and everything else, okay? So make sure that when you shut this video off, before you do, you watch it again, but at the same time, you take what I just gave you and you implement it immediately. That's the first step. Implement immediately. That's the question I get. What do I do? I wanna start a business. What's the first thing? You implement what you learn, period. Because there's so many people asking the same fucking questions and they don't understand. Take what I do in a video, don't watch anything else yet, watch it again if you have to, and then whatever I, I give you, implement it right away. And watch how everything is gonna change immediately. Okay, that's it for this one, guys. Hit the thumbs up if you haven't. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I will see you on the next video.